What's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I'm going to walk you through this glute focus leg workout I did the other day. Just to get right into it, I'm doing these lateral banded walks with a barbell. And the point of the resistance band is to apply more tension throughout the entirety of the exercise. There is constant stress being applied to my glute muscles. If you do not have a resistance band, don't worry. Just try to sit as far down as you can into a squat. I'm really trying to sit down here as far as I can, and as you can see, it's not very far. These hurt really bad. And I did 16 steps on each leg. Then I went and supersetted it with the single leg sit squats. And if you aren't aware, the glutes play a really large role in hip extension and hip hyperextension. If you bring your knees to your chest, that is called hip flexion. And if you were to stand up, that is hip extension. And if you kick your leg back, that is hip hyperextension. So I'm really focusing on the extension and hyperextension of the hip joint during this exercise in order to activate and target the glutes. For these sit squats particularly, you want to really keep your core nice and tight. If you're wiggling around, you really want to have that stability in your core or just lower the weight. And as you can see, every time I stand up, I squeeze my glutes and make sure I am activating them. Then I went into these hip thrusts with a dumbbell. And my gym isn't very easy to set up a barbell hip thrust, so I just do what I can and use a dumbbell. I check the positioning of my back by sticking my arms out like that and then... I have my feet kind of angled outwards at a 45 degree angle and when I do these I make sure to look at where the wall is hitting the ceiling. I don't want to be looking straight up at the ceiling because that's going to strain my neck and cause unnecessary stress to my spine. And here I'm showing you how I use it with the band. It's kind of like a two step motion. You go up and then you bring your knees outward like that. And so again, the resistance band is going to apply even more tension to the glute and externally rotating the hip is going to target them even more, which is what we want. Again, my feet are pointed out and I'm trying to stare at where the wall meets the ceiling. And then I supersetted the hip thrust with the single leg step ups with hip extension. I've never actually done this workout or exercise before, so I just use body weight. And again, you want to keep your core really tight to make sure you're stable and not wiggling around. And when you get up, you kick your knee back and you're going to squeeze the glutes. Again, if you are wiggling around, maybe check the bench that you're using. If there's too much padding, that may also make it more difficult and you may use some sort of step up instead of this kind of bench. And now we're getting into the cable kickbacks. And I hear a lot of girls have issues with feeling this in their glutes and they feel it more in their thigh muscles. So some things I like to focus on when I kick back, I turn my foot outward slightly and I find that external rotation lets me hit my glute even more. And also when the weight is going down or I'm bringing my knee back forward, I don't let gravity do the work and I don't use my thigh muscles to bring the weight down. I really try to pinpoint the lower part of my glute that is working and I make sure to keep that part engaged all the way back down. 
And in this clip, I think you can see it better where my foot is turned outward slightly when I'm kicking back. And you also want to keep your back straight as you can. And then I went into these plated hip abductions. So I'm just holding a 10 pound plate at my side. I'm making my leg push against the weight. My hand is simply keeping it there. It's not doing any of the work. And if you're having a hard time with feeling this in your glutes, I'd recommend bending at the knee a little bit. I like to kind of go slower on the way down, again just so that I'm applying more tension to the muscle and not letting gravity do any of the work for me. I hope you guys liked this glute focused leg workout and like and subscribe. <laughs>